What is up YouTube? It is Extensive Tactical here. I am here doing another EDC video for you guys. A EDC video for you guys. I was just in the middle of one. I got interrupted, so I am now having to redo the video. Uh, I will go over my EDC. So first off, very first thing I carry on my right side is a buck 110. If you watch my other uh, EDC video on YouTube, you will see I had this same knife. The tip on it was broken off and I had to file it down. Got the Leatherman OHT. Multi-tool I've been carrying for quite a while now. Next are my keys. I got the Gerber Dime. Sog tool, truck key, and a key bar. Alright. Reason I'm covering what I drive and stuff is I might be uh, doing a thing where I have you guys guess what I drive and then whoever gets it right, I might be giving the truck to or whatever uh, because I'm about to get a new Cummins. So. Yeah, I might be. I don't know yet. I might give y'all something else. Anyway, uh, a way to hold and carry band-aids. Fire starter. Right, right. Fishing kit. I got my card holder. Gerber Impromptu Tactical Pin right there is the carbide glass breaker. It does take a Fisher Space Pin uh, refill insert. So that's a good thing. I got my little Night Eyes doohickey here. Multi-tool. Alright. Always good to have in your pocket. Next thing on my belt, besides the knife and the multi-tool, or is a seat belt cutter. Always good to have, alright? I carry a Tinder tin with some fat wood in it to help start fires. I got the... Um, Leather wallet I made with a red bandana over here. Is you can see red bandana right there, folks. Alright, I got some extra change over here with my marine coin. As you can see, Eagle Globe and Anchor. Alright. Next is my uh, flashlight. Alright. I'm in such a good mood today because I'm currently home from the Marine Corps. Uh, yes, I do serve our country. I am very glad I do, and I am proud to do it over and over to give you guys uh, the freedom you have. I got the uh, fire starter carry on my neck, and the dog tags. Okay, I get questions all the time about how the Marine Corps does dog tags, and I'm going to go over it here with you guys. Give me just a second. I am uh, fixing the silencers on here. Okay, anyway, the way we put our information on here is, and it's good to memorize this, okay, it's last name, first name, and then middle initial, okay, then it's your blood type, then it is your religion, and then under that is your gas mask size, alright, that is the way the U.S. Marine Corps does it. I don't know how the Army does it, I don't know how the Air Force does it, or the Coast Guard, or the Navy. I know the SEALs, I think, do it the same way the Navy does. I could be wrong. Oh. But, the way the Marine Corps does it, I do know because that is the branch I am in. I will be going to in the SEALs here soon, and uh, working with them. So, yeah. Um, I don't have everything. Some of my stuff is out in the truck. Um, I am about, about to get some new gear. And uh, I will go over that with you guys. This is my dog. Her name is Scout. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. See? She said hi. She waved at you guys and stuff. So, smart dog, right? Anyway, um, yeah. Y'all have a good day. Stay safe. Stay blessed. Stay prepared. And remember, your enemies shall be done before you. Alright? Remember, don't, don't ever underestimate your opponent, but always, always be able to anticipate your enemy, enemy's every move. Alright? That's the number one rule, even as a civilian. You want to be able to anticipate people's every move, alright? 
so uh and to go with that i've got a story all right i've got a little brother all right his name is dj um i got a call from his principal uh three four days ago right before i ever got home and they told me he had gotten into a fight at school i said all right um, I asked him what happened when I got home last night. He told me. He walked me through it. Apparently, a kid tried to kick a ball out from under him when he was sitting on it. He gets up. He asks the kid to stop. He goes to sit down. Kid does it again. He stands up. Kid goes, I'm not afraid of you. My little brother tells him, you don't need to be. I know how to handle myself. The kid goes, okay, then fight me then. My little brother gets in his face, and he goes, dude, I'm not the one you want to fuck with. You don't know who I am. And then, apparently, the kid has a friend jump in, and he goes, and you don't know who he is or who I am. And so, these ki both these kids are standing there in their, my little brother's face. They both turn around and yell, you better get this motherfucker off me. And teacher grabs my little brother. They both sock him in the face. My little brother hits both of them once and knocks them both out. And that is because I taught my little brother the hand-to-hand -hand combat stuff um, that I have learned. I've been doing martial arts since age five. Uh, so, I am a dangerous person, okay? I did a martial art called Krav Maga. It is the Israeli uh, military martial art. It teaches you how to kill people a bunch of different ways with your bare hands, alright? So... That is what I specialized in. I wanted to learn how to kill people effectively in a fight. Um, because I'm not going to sit there and fight with you for what could possibly turn into uh, being an hour. Um, and wait for the cops to get there. I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to kill you and get home to the people I have. Next thing I want to go over to is a screwdriver. I just carried that first shits and giggles all right um thing i have in the truck i was gonna go over is my copenhagen all right i do carry that um it is a common misperception that people have okay they think um that all people in the marine corps do copenhagen long coat winter green okay that's not true um just like everyone in the Navy doesn't dip Copenhagen Mint, okay? And if they do, then they're, I mean, the Navy's a bunch of pussies anyway. Now, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking, oh, ho, 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 you're a department of the Navy. <laughs> you're right. I am a department of the Navy, but you know what? I'm the men's department, all right? So... For those Marines, those uh, of you out there that are Marines, next time one of your Navy buddies says something to you about, oh, you're a Department of the Navy when you make a Navy joke, say, you're right, I am, but I'm the men's department, right? So, yeah, that's, that's what I do for you guys. I do these videos for you, and I serve for you. I would gladly, if I got killed... I die happily because I'm giving you guys freedom. Not technically giving you guys freedom, but I'm fighting for you guys to have freedom. Okay? Now she's sitting here trying to eat my phone. I guess she thinks it's going to taste good or something. Anyway, YouTube, I'm out of here. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Wonderful week. I'll do another one uh, later and go over all my new gear. Alright? So... I love you guys. I hope you guys stay safe, stay blessed, and remember, always be happy. And remember, don't ever underestimate your opponent unless it is your enemy. Your enemy needs to have their every move anticipated. So remember, anticipate your enemy's every move. Love you guys. Stay safe.